Welcome back with an update on the White Island Volcano. Um, it's having like some plumes pop up. Oh, that's the plume. Okay, that would be thumbnail too. Um, yeah. Anyways, significant amounts of gas and steam, large plume visible from mainland. GNS volcanologists performed two observation flights of the volcano to observe and measure gas emissions over the past week. An abundant amount of steam and gas emissions at a temperature of 240 degrees Celsius. I think that's like the temperature on the hot side of Mercury. Um, has been emitted from the main crater floor during the gas flight on March 9th. To compare with previous temperature analysis, it used to be detected more than 600 degrees Celsius. That's the temperature Venus, if I'm not mistaken, in the past. Um, an increasingly larger gas plume could be seen rising from, also from the mainland on March 5th, observed by surveillance cameras as well, although gas influxes have increased to the previous measurements, they still remain within the usual range of the volcano. Every rainfall over the past month caused the crater lake levels to rise. As a result, some fumaroles are now underwater, leading to geysering and bubbling. No signs of volcanic ash in the plume or other eruptive activity were observed during the flights. Both alerts for the a um, aviation color code and volcanic alert level remains at, lev at yellow and level 2, respectively. So basically, just avoid the island. We don't want a repeat of what happened in 2020 where people went to the island and died. Um, because it decided to go boom. And yeah, that's about it. Stay safe out there. See you in the next video. Bye.